Hi, this is Heather. Today we're going to show you how to cast on for knitting. And the first thing we're going to do is make a slip knot. I'm just going to take a piece of yarn. It's hard to tell how much yarn you need for a certain amount of chain. But we're just going to chain a, this piece here. So I'm going to do a slip knot first. There are many ways to do it, so you don't have to do it exactly this way. I make an X. I'm going to put my thumb here, fold my two fingers over, lift this up, put the yarn through, grab it with my thumb so it doesn't get lost, let my hand go, and that is our slip knot. Take my knitting needle, put that through, and then I'm going to tighten it. And now we're ready to start. We're going to lay the two pieces of yarn, make sure they're straight and not turned. Hold them in the palm. I'm going to fold my hands over. Take the thumb and the index, put it between those two strands, and stretch it out. And I'm going to rotate my left hand and I'm going to lower my right hand a little and then you have your what they call a slingshot. And so in order to do our first we are going to go under the thumb then bring the needle back to the original position go under the index Bring the needle back to the original position, go down through the thumb, let your left hand fingers go, and this is going to tighten the stitch if you pull. And so we'll do the next. There is a shortcut I'll show you after I show several of these, but you want to know the basics before you want to know the shortcut. So we're going to put it in the palm of our hand. Close the fingers, have your thumb and your index go between the two strands, and you're going to stretch them out. Rotate your left hand, pull on it if you need some yarn, and then lower your right hand. And then first we're going to go under the thumb. Bring the needle back to the original position, go under the index, bring your needle back to the original position, and you're going to go down through your thumb and let your half, left hand fingers go and just pull to tighten. And we're going to do that again. Hold it in our hand, close our fingers, take the thumb and the index and go between the two strands, stretch them out. Rotate your left hand and then lower your right. And now you're in the position. You're going to go under your thumb. And then bring your needle to the original position. Under your index finger. And bring your hand, your needle to the original position and go down through your thumb. Then you can let your fingers go on your left hand and then pull to tighten. And we'll do one more and then I can show you the shortcut. Put it in the palm of our hand, close our hands. Take your thumb and index finger and go between. And your other fingers are holding it. And now spread this out. Lower your, rotate your left hand and lower your right. And then we're going to do a stitch. We're going to go under the thumb, under the index, or over the index. Bring your hand to the original, your needle to the original position, and then go under the thumb. And then we tighten by pulling. And the shortcut will alleviate um, the first step when you put the yarn in the palm of your hands. So we'll do that again. Close our hands, 
put the thumb and index finger through the two strands and stretch them. Rotate the left hand, lower the right. And we're going to go under the thumb. Bring the needle back to the original position, go under through the index finger. Bring it back to the original position and go down through the thumb. And if you want to do a shortcut, since your thumb and index finger are right here, all you have to do is tighten it and you're in your position. All you'd have to do is rotate the left hand and lower the right. And we'll do that again. Under the thumb, up and over the index, bring your needle to the original position and then go down through your thumb. Let your fingers go on your left hand and since the two strands are here and your thumb and your index are here, tighten it by doing that and then you're in your position again. And we'll do it one more time. Rotate the left hand, lower the right, go under the thumb, bring the needle back to the original position, go under the index finger, bring it back to the original position, go under the thumb, let your fingers go on your left hand, don't have much yarn left, there we go. And now we're going to tighten it and then you're in your the position to do your next cast on. I hope this video helps. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.